skin cancer rates are skyrocketing. And as much as I hate to admit it, dermatologists like me may be part of the problem. Let me explain. When you think of sun protection, what's the first thing that comes to mind? Sunscreen, right? And that's the issue. And no, it's not because sunscreen causes cancer. That's never been shown to be true, and it's ludicrous to say so. It's because here in America, we've been taught to use sunscreen as our first line of defense against the sun. The reality is 95% of the UV radiation that reaches us here on Earth is UVA. And we already know that UVA penetrates our skin deeply, passing through clouds, glass, and is present all year round, not just in the summer. And what blows my mind, based on a recent study, is that most, about 75 to 85% of our UV exposure, comes from indirect or diffuse rays, meaning when we're not directly facing the sun. So that means we're not even really protected from the sun, even when we're in the shade. It's all about perpendicular exposure, not direct. We need to cover up using UV protective clothing, wide brim hats, gloves, you name it. And we need to change our mindset, shifting sunscreen away from our first line of defense and replacing it with covering up. Now don't get me wrong, sunscreen is still very important, we just can't solely rely on it. And that's why skin cancer rates are likely going up, because sunscreen isn't the only answer. It's giving us a false sense of security when we really should be covering up. But let me know what you think, and if you want me to do a deep dive into the study that showed these results, let me know in the comments below.